guys, welcome to another video. What's up guys? Um, today I'm gonna do a, uh, not really unboxing, but I'm just, uh, if you follow my Instagram, I kind of teased that this bag of uh, goodies is here and I'm just gonna reveal what's inside. Um, it's just stuff that I've had from the past and I just wanted to, I don't know, maybe use it in the future. So I brought it from my parents' house. I'm gonna clean it up. I'm gonna um, see if I can utilize any of that stuff. And maybe we can put that on today. I don't know, we'll see. I'm also gonna do a, uh, a little video about uh, doing these, uh, these little trims, the front trims. Sorry. The front window trims right here. Oh yeah, these are here. Uh, I'm just gonna remove them. The rich, the owner before me took this one off. I actually have it here, but uh, I'm gonna um, try to refurb all of them and then figure out a way to actually mount it up here. And uh, just trying to um, do something, cause you know, like I sometimes I wait to see if I have things to do. And I don't want to actually make videos unless I'm doing something. But I think, you know, some people appreciate vlogging. So it's kind of like a half vlog, half uh, video about doing something on the Corolla. And I want to I want to be consistent with my uploads. Uh, I'm thinking maybe like every Monday, Wednesday, Monday, Wednesday, Saturday. Or I'll figure out a system where it works for me. And then uh, we'll try to keep uploading so that it's consistent, people know what to expect. Cause I wanna do this. I mean, if you want to, if you wanna support this channel, you wanna see some builds, I actually have some t-shirts for sale on uh, eBay. Um, just look for Club 86 t-shirts and they should be up there. Um, I think uh, there's only two left right now. But hit me up, hit me up in the comments if you want a t-shirt. Um, um, and here we go. All right, so uh, let's tackle this uh, trim piece here. What you need to do is you need to open it, and you see there's like uh, this um, seal. We're gonna have to peel this. Let's see, he's not gonna see. Kind of peel it out from the front, back, like this. Just kind of pull all the way out, and this will reveal to you the screws that you need to remove. Okay, there it goes. That's it. This piece right here. This is this piece that blocks, hides the the screws that you need to remove. So there's three screws and it should just come off. I'm gonna try to remove this without removing this seal here. We shall see. Left.
All right, guys, so let's see what's in here. I have this stored away for a few years. U.S. driver's side, a JDM passenger side, really dirty. <sighs> Cracked right here, but all the brackets are still there. Mounting point, let's call that good. Two screw holes, lens is still good. Just take this little glue off. Damn, all right. All the flaps. No idea what these are. Maybe 86s, yeah? You guys probably know. Oh. Well, maybe they are just not cooking. Maybe they, maybe they fit zinky bumpers? Maybe. If I cut this, if I want to, these, this is bent. Let's see if I can bend it back. That's it. That's the reveal. JDM brackets, corner light, 11. These are. Let's see if we can make these fit. All right, so we're back at this trim piece. I had to take a break because I was frustrated at uh, not being able to pull it off. And in the past, they have just come off. And so I'm wondering maybe something's up with it. And then I had to go check uh, Keep A86 Alive, his video about him removing it. And it just 
it just came off super nice for him. And so, as janky as my car is, I'm not surprised that I'm having issues. So let's just try to pry it off and just gung ho it. I suppose what they say about the grass being greener is right, but I'm starting to hate my car more and more every day. I'll just uh, show you when I'm done. All right, so after like 15 minutes of uh, Asian persuasion, I'm able to just have it sit nice again. It was such a hassle to just have it take it off, just to take it off. And so I kind of bent it up when I took it off um, because the, I always blame the previous owner, but it really is them. They, they added some extra glue here or whoever put the new window in or something added extra um, sealant here and so it stuck to the back of this and so it was such a pain but it's such a specific bend it took me a while I straightened everything out straightened the inside of this out and then uh, bent it up to sit correctly again and uh, now it's actually pretty decent I'm gonna end this video here because I gotta go feed my kids. But, um, the gap is decent here. Everything lines up, everything bolts up. And but then the next video, I'll sand this down and um, get it.